Hey folks, Sheila here from Design Files. I wanted to pop on with a quick video because the team has added a great new update to the mood board software for you. And that new update is our board panel, which you're going to see at the bottom of the mood board editor. Now, when you log into the mood board editor, it's going to look like this. So you just have to click this option at the bottom. It will expand and it's going to show you all the design boards that you've created within the project. Now, what's awesome about this is that you can now quickly jump from design to design uh, within the editor without always having to, you know, save your design and then go back to the uh, app and then select the next design board and then reopen the mood board editor. Now you can just quickly jump from them within the actual mood board software and it'll speed up that process for you. Now, because we have this new board panel in, it actually comes with a lot of additional perks. So for one thing, you can see here that I've created an entire client presentation. So I've got all kinds of slides, including uh, my mood board, my floor plan, lighting plan, renders, all kinds of stuff within this presentation. And if I wanted to change up the order of these design boards to match up with my table of contents, I can just click on any of the design boards down here and I can shift them around so that I can replace them within the design or within the actual kind of order for these uh, design boards. So it's really quick and easy to do that. Now, other things that you can actually do with this uh, new board panel is you can actually copy and paste elements from one design board to another. So if you wanted to copy products or paint swatches or text, you would just click on any item that you want to copy. You can actually click on a group of items if you want, but then you would hit control C um, to copy the item. If you're on a Mac, you'll hit command C and then go over to the other design board that you want to add this item to, and then just hit control V again. If you're on a Mac, you'll hit command V. You'll see the item is pasted to this design board. Now I can scale it down and place it wherever I want. So it makes it really easy for you to just copy any elements from one design board and save it to another. And when you're ready, just go ahead and save that design. So you have everything the way you want. Um, other things that you can actually do with the board panel, you can come over to any of the boards within the panel, click the button with the three dots, and you'll see you have the option to delete the design or you can duplicate it. So in this case, let's say that I'm going to click on my mood board design here, and maybe I want to duplicate this design because I want to show my client two different design takes on this. So I can duplicate the design. I can jump over to the duplicated one, and then I can start switching out any of the products and show alternative options. So my client has two designs that they can choose from. If I ever need to delete any designs, I would just hover over the little button with the three dots and delete that item or that whole design board. Now, one last thing that I'll just bring to your attention here, you do have the option to also create a brand new design directly from the board panel. So you can click this option at the end. It's going to ask you if you want to create a mood board or a floor plan. So I'm going to go ahead and create a mood board. And if you've been taking advantage of the ability to create branded templates within your design files account, then you could just grab any of your branded templates and then add that to your presentation. So in my case, I would definitely want to do that because I've got a specific look that I'm going for, for all of these uh, branded slides. And I want to make sure I'm replicating that for any new designs that I'm creating. So by adding in my branded footer here, it's pulling in the appropriate color that I want for my slide. It's pulling in all the elements that I have on all the other design boards within this presentation. I can just save this. And then um, what I can do is I can start editing this design so I can bring in any visual elements. I can change out the text and just create that next page within my presentation. So that basically sums it up. Um, definitely jump into your design files account. Give this new board panel a try. It's really going to speed things up for you because now you can quickly jump from board to board from within the mood board software. You can copy uh, items, text, paint swatches, any elements you want from one design board to another. You can change the order of your design boards. You can add new design boards. You can delete design boards. It really will speed up so many of those kind of different scenarios that you're going to go through whenever you're creating your designs. And of course, if you have any questions at all, feel free to reach out to us on the live chat. We're always happy to help.